So what is this AI factory that we're talking about? First of all, AI factories are a lot bigger than the data center of the past. We're talking capacity and installations going from megawatts to gigawatts. We're also seeing innovation cycles compressing, where things used to change in years. We're now talking about six months increments because this is what the GPU industry operates at. And this needs to be absorbed in the electrical infrastructure. The same point of time was shifting from air cooling of the past to liquid cooling. And so I hope you're getting a sense of the complexities that are coming into play here. What this means for us is that system performance is becoming a whole lot more important. By about 2030, we expect that about 70% of the data center fleet around the world will be able to run AI workloads. But with that come pretty significant technology shifts. So let me translate this into the portfolio that we as a company can bring to the table. We can enable customers to shorten time to market. How do we do this? Through digital designs, we enable hyperscalers to design for constructability. I mean, through skidding solutions, we help them cut the time to bring infrastructure to life while also in parallel optimizing energy efficiency. And when you're talking about a gigawatt facility, every tenth of a percent that you can shave off in energy consumption counts. For us, this translates into a significant need for innovation, a significant opportunity to bring new technology into the marketplace.